$42 million. This is the amount of money that Kylian Mbappe will earn in 2020 according to the Forbes ranking. But how does the Paris player spend his millions? Kylian Mbappe is a sensation, an anomaly. He may well be the fourth highest paid footballer in the world at only 21 years old, but he doesn't show off about it. But we'll come back to this later. Since the world champion signed for PSG, he hasn't gone on any mad spending sprees. My biggest expense? A nice house. It's important for my family. He moved with his family into a 6,400 square foot split level apartment in the most expensive neighborhood in Paris. His giant apartment gives him a breathtaking view of the Eiffel Tower. There's even a deck with a jacuzzi. That's a bit different from our crusty old bathtubs. It's only a rental, but it is so luxurious that it costs hundreds of thousands of dollars a year. The Mbappe family also has a house in Monaco. Hey, if you're watching this video, it means you love learning about little known stories around football. You're lucky because we'll tell you a story every day on our channel. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe and turn on notifications right now to become a true football expert. Kylian Mbappe hasn't passed his driving test yet, but he will soon. So a driver accompanies him wherever he goes. But he doesn't pay for these trips, so they aren't included in his expenses. Essentially, his PSG contract allocates him a sum of $36,000 that he can use to pay a driver or his rent. That being said, Kylian Mbappe may own the most expensive car in League One according to specialist automobile media. He may have a Ferrari worth $577,000 in his garage. Not bad. We'll come back to the Ferrari later. Kylian Mbappe has living expenses like all footballers. Luxury clothes, entertainment, vacations. But there's no concrete information about this. We don't do fake news here. C'est bien, c'est bien. On l'applaudit, s'il vous plaît. However, there are a lot of donations among his many expenses. The Mbappes are very generous. Like here, for example. This is the opening ceremony for his charity. Maintenant que je suis à, à cette place-là, j'ai envie de, de redonner et euh, de pouvoir aider les, les plus jeunes. Donc c'est avec grand plaisir. During the coronavirus crisis, he made a huge donation to a major charity in France. Mbappe also contributed to the collection that was raising money to fund the search for the body of Emiliano Sala and the pilot, who disappeared in the channel at the start of 2019. In 2018, he gave his entire World Cup bonus of more than $415,000 to a charity. In short, Mbappe earns a lot. He enjoys it, but he also gives a lot to charities. Now back to the Ferrari story. His mother Faiza keeps an eye out. She stops him from getting intoxicated with fame. She validates all of Killian's choices. She thinks that he's too young to have a Ferrari until he's got his driver's license and prefers that he wears a watch that isn't the most expensive version or the most flashy. It looks like Killian has a bit more independence because there's a Ferrari in his garage now. But when it comes to watches, he's partnered with the luxury brand Hublot, so he doesn't have much of a choice. But you get the idea. The Mbappe family pays attention to their son so he doesn't lose his way. We're not short of examples of wasted talents in football, and money is sometimes a key factor in a player's failure. That's why we haven't talked about yachts, helicopters, Iron Man suits, and deserted islands in this video. You get it. Kylian Mbappe doesn't have any flashy expenses, and that doesn't make him any less cool. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave us a like and please subscribe to the channel. Now, the voice is yours. Give us your ideas for new videos in the comments.